All right, this is a really big misconception in the ballet world, and I'm gonna bring in some evidence and hopefully I change your mind. So my statement in my other video was saying that Baganva is the best method of training. I've studied under every style and I found that only through a Baganova pedagogical system did I really improve. Yeah, we can make a big generalization that ballet is not that inclusive. 100% agree, but that has changed a lot over time. You look at the Soviet dancers like Maximova, etc. These were some of the best people ever and they had normal body types. You see the shift really happen as soon as Balanchine emerged, so. I have learned a lot of my ballet information from Ballet Conrad, so I really recommend you watch their YouTube and TikTok. When I was training at professional schools, I would watch these videos, and I say I've probably watched over a hundred hours of Ballet Conrad. Unfortunately, I feel like if you haven't seen Ballet Conrad, don't even know who they are, I kind of consider your opinion irrelevant. I literally have never met someone that explains ballet better than Ballet Conrad. What Ballet Conrad essentially does is break down the Vaganova method into bite-sized pieces where we can kind of all digest it. Cause I myself have gone to Bolshoi in Russia and there's a lot to know, you know, the kids go there for eight years and it's each year moving up, building up, building up exams and topics, um, acting, character, historical, ballet, point, duet, you know? I'm being super frank and not adding a lot of nuance, but tell me, in any other style, do you guys study the characters, read the books, you know, go to acting class? Because you don't. I know you don't, because it's required in Russia. It's required in the Vaganova method. And I know that artistry is one of the most important things in ballet, but other styles don't have acting class and probably haven't even read Don Q, haven't read any, you know, book related to the ballet they're playing. I'm not omnipotent, I'm not all-knowing, but I've been around to so many schools and I'm just telling you, it's only Russian dancers that study this. <laughs> Everywhere else, they just tell you to like smile or look sassy, but in Russia, in the Vaganova method, it's about becoming a character. In regards to classical ballet, the Vaganova method is the best. In regards to inclusivity, I would say across the board, it's bad everywhere. There's just different coding, different language around the world because I've experienced a lot of fat shaming in America too and Europe, everywhere. So 